Hi, this is Peter Dart's Clairvoyant here, and I'm doing your astrology star sign here for February the 12th to the 18th for Aries. So let's see what we get for you, Aries. So let's just focus on relationships first, okay? So let's just pull three cards out here. Right, so I feel for you, Aries, now, it's like I feel so there's a lot of potential now for you to grow emotionally. But I just feel so for some of it, you feel a little bit let down by somebody close to you or you feel like you're not getting the attention that you need. There's this feeling of being let down, not supported. So it's like I feel so at the moment, you feel like you're being pulled in different directions and you try and figure things out what to do, where you're kind of going, where you're heading. But I just feel as so though as the week progresses, things will get easier and better. But I just feel so you just got to keep moving forward now as best as you possibly can. Okay. Now, let's have a look at work and career for you throughout the week. Now, work and career, I just feel as though here, there seems to be a lot of competition around you or a lot of people around you that you're working with. And sometimes it feels like we're all trying to do the same thing or achieve the same goal. So sometimes it's like I feel as though you've got to sort of try and stand out a little bit, do something a little bit different. Sometimes it isn't always about working harder, but working smarter. So they may be running around like idiots, but are they getting the job done right? You could be working at a bit of a slower pace, but getting the job done correctly. So who's coming to the finish line? Because really they're not, because they've got to do it all again. So maybe that's the way to look at it. But I do feel from your experiences and the way you analyse things going on around you, you will gain what's going on, okay? And I feel so all you've got to do here with the Empress coming out is nurture your thoughts and ideas. But I do get growth, I do get gain, I do get you moving forward. And even if you are running your own business, I feel like the same thing kind of applies. Sometimes you just got to put the quality in and not the negative or rush it about. Sometimes it's better to come last but to get it done correctly. So this is what I feel so you've got to focus on. Right, let's have a look at family. Right, so with family, I just feel so you're trying to connect with family here, but sometimes you find it difficult and hard. But I just feel so don't worry. I just feel so you're going to get where you need to be. And there are going to be some changes the way you connect with family and interact with family. And also I feel so you're going to focus on wanting to travel more, whether it's your own little unit or the wider family. But I just feel so that's okay. But I just feel so don't worry too much what everybody else is doing. Stay focused on what you're doing. Sorry about that. I don't know what the hell that was then. That just beeped off. Uh, so stay focused on what you're doing and where you're kind of going, okay? And then let's just have a look at money and finances. Right, so money and finances seem to be okay because I've got the sun card coming out, which shows me settlement and joy. I feel as though making decisions very quickly, but some things that are difficult ones, I feel so just take your time a little bit more. But do also be uh, sort of wary of some shock bills coming up around you. But other than that, I just feel as though money seems to be okay. And let's have a look at how for you. Health doesn't seem to be too bad at the moment. I've got you sort of feeling quite positive because you've got your Wheel of Fortune back in your other valve. So that comes out very positive, okay? You've got your wishes and dreams. So here you might be trying to achieve something, whether it's losing weight or, or keeping a little bit fitter and active, okay? So you'll do a bit of reflecting on this, how to go about it. But overall, I just feel that the energy seems fine. And then let's see what we get with children. Okay, so with children, I've got you sort of, you know, trying to be there in a very motherly and fatherly way, okay? You're trying to feel strong and empowered to get things done with them. You're trying to remove all obstacles that you've been finding difficult or whether there's a certain child that you're connecting with where they're feeling a bit sort of, you know, not quite themselves and it's making it difficult for you to connect with them. 
So you're looking at this, you're analysing it, and you're trying to let all the negativity sort of down a little bit in the woods so you can move forward and get where you need to be with family and children. So hope you've enjoyed that. Hope that's made sense. And I'll see you all next week. Thank you. Bye-bye.